I'm a great mother. I am not abusing my daughter. I am disciplining her. She will push my buttons. It just makes me lose it. I've gotten so angry with her that I've told her before that I'm gonna knock her teeth out. I said that my worst mistake was having her. One time, my daughter threw a remote and barely missed me, and it's a good thing she did because I was pretty much ready to kill her at that point. There have been times that I've had to smack my daughter one time. We were in the car and she was back talking and I backhanded her. She didn't even see it coming and that pretty much stopped that situation right then. About four months ago, I put the fear of God in my daughter. She was back talking and I had her pinned down on the floor and I was yelling and screaming at her while I was busy punching the floor, asking her if this is how she wanted to live. Because of my daughter's bad attitude, living in my house is like a war zone 24-7. Okay, well my first question is to you, because you're her mom. Yes. So, how did you discipline her? She, when she was very little, she had a spank on the butt, and then from that point on, if she did something wrong, she was grounded. Did you ever call her a bitch? No. Did you ever tell her you were gonna beat the crap out of her? No. She was not raised that way at all. Where, where did you learn that parenting style? I don't necessarily, it was like something that I picked up. Uh, I just do what works. My daughter is coming into the teenage years and we need to figure out what works discipline wise for her. Okay, so you're just doing this because it works. I'm trying everything that works. Jade may have to do 12 chores because she's was assigned a chore for back talking and then she continued to back talk so then she got assigned another chore shauna and i've clearly discussed <clears throat> this many times that i believe that you know she's just using jade as a slave well okay but let's let, let's forget about for a minute not for much longer than a minute but let's forget about for a minute whether this is crossing the line from discipline to abuse or chores to a slave. It seems to me that right now, this minute, as of today, you have a very contentious relationship with your daughter that she is rebellious and out of control and disrespectful. It just seems to me like see, this isn't feel... even almost working even a little bit. <laughs> Well, that is part of the problem is that, you know, finding a discipline. Nobody wants to hit their child. I do not want to continuously put my hands on my child. Um, I don't. It makes you as a parent feel absolutely guilty <clears throat> when you, even when they're little and you have to smack them. It makes you have that guilt that you carry but around with you. But you're not answering my question. Okay. Perhaps I'm not expressing it clearly. Why are you doing this if it doesn't work? because I have no other form of discipline for her right now that is working. Why are you doing this if it doesn't work? Okay. Well, if it, because listen, if it doesn't work, then hell, why not do nothing? If it doesn't work, why do anything? Well, basically the whole reason I'm doing this right now is because I'm trying to follow the steps that her therapist laid out that we should be following. Okay.